Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do something a little bit different than what I've been posting lately. So my channel, as you know, focuses on planning, organization, lifestyle, DIYs, etc. And I've been posting a lot of planner related videos lately, which I absolutely love, but I wanted to do um, something a little different today. That is a what's in my purse. These videos were so fun to watch years ago. Then they kind of drifted away and they're definitely making a comeback so i wanted to do one myself because i love my purse and on top of that i think i have some really fun little useful products in here that you guys might find interesting so let's get into it this is my coach crossbody it is the jess j-e-s bag with the i don't know if this is debossed or embossed logo on the front instead of having like a metal logo put on there or something flashy so my style is more minimal i wear a lot of neutral colors i don't wear a lot of jewelry so i like my handbags when they don't have much hardware on them um, this doesn't have a lot that's why i like the look of this on the front and coach for many years has been one of my favorite handbag brands so I love this bag. Let us get into it. So right on the side of my purse here, I just keep my keys. I have a little coach holder on here. And I also have a tile. I have my keys, obviously. And a little fun fact, um, when I was a kid, my mom always did this to her keys as well. She would take nail polish and color code them so that you know what they're to. So growing up, I always did that with like my house keys and stuff. So now I do it to all of my keys. And every couple years I just refresh the color because it does start to flake off over um, time. But on the top of it, I actually put my favorite clear coat, which is the Seche V nail polish. And it really seals it in well for a while. Then I have my car keys on here and I have this little keychain that my sister got me maybe like 15 years ago or something. And um, I absolutely love it. It's held up so well and it's by Coach. I love Coach, like I said. And it's a little bumblebee because my nickname is Bee and a watering can and a flower because I am a florist. So it just suits me. So those are my keys. And I love when my keys have these little kind of hooks on it because then I can just hook it right to the side of my purse and not worry about it taking up space in my bag because I like to carry smaller size bags, like medium to small size bags. I guess this would be like a medium size. Then what's taking up a bulk of space in here, which this is not always in here, but depending where I'm going and what I'm gonna be working on, I do keep this. This is my iPad mini. I have an entire video of a review on this case and it is the keyboard case that I use for it. And if you guys are interested in an amazing keyboard case so you could turn your iPad into sort of like a little laptop and be able to work easily on the go, then go check out my review on that. And it is one of my recent videos. So that's in there right now. It's not always in there though. Then of course I have my planner, always have my planner. This is my Moterm pocket planner in the light gray. Of course, if you guys follow me or watch my planner flip throughs, you guys know that this is the planner that I carry around with me. And if you're interested in seeing my flip throughs, you can check those out as well. There are some recent videos on my channel. And if you're also interested in doing DIY tabs, like I did the clear transparent um, dividers, you could check out my DIY video that I have on that as well. So that is what is the bulk in my bag that takes up a lot of space in the back. Now my bag is not like bulky, but even with just this, like it fits in there great. It's just the iPad mini kind of bulks it out more. And sometimes I even just leave it unzipped because they're big items and they're not gonna fall out. Let me see. I also, I don't have anything. There's like a slip pocket in the back here. And then down here, I just keep my Apple Pencil dupe which I have a video on that as well. It's in the same video as my keyboard review. So great, I've had these items for a while and I just love them. Don't think I have anything else in this back pocket. That's pretty much like my organization stuff, like my planner and my laptop or iPad. Front pocket is probably a mess. Let's look in here. Okay, so the first thing that I'm pulling out is this little pouch. Got it from Amazon. It is definitely inspired by Louis Vuitton. 
the Damier pattern. However, it does not have the logo on it. It's just inspired by the pattern of the canvas. And I love this little pouch. It's a perfect size. I've had it for a long time and it's held up great. I mean, it's always thrown in here. In this little pouch, um, I will show you. It does have this because this is definitely inspired by the key clay by Louis Vuitton. So it does have the little hook so you can hang it from your keys if you want, but I don't use that part. I just have this, one of my absolute favorite tools ever. It's um, the thing that has the nail clipper on it. It has a knife, nail file, and scissor. And I cannot tell you how many times this comes in handy, especially being a mom. Like my daughter constantly gets little tiny fingernails that need to be trimmed off or if we get things and I need to snip off a tag or you know something sharp, like I always have this on me. And it's also great as like just having for protection, like God forbid anything would ever happen. It's just nice to know that you have something to defend yourself with. But I do love this. This was such a great investment. I've had it for so long. Amazon has like some of the best stuff ever, <laughs> swear. I'll link it below. Then I just have some really old wet wipes from Chick-fil-A in here. I have allergy medicine or mucinex. That might be mucinex. Yep, mucinex and allergy medicine. I have some Tums in here. Have Tylenol. I have this little sampler of perfume. It's Honey by Marc Jacobs. This smells so good. And I have like just the littlest drop left. <laughs> I'm just savoring it. Then I have these little toothpicks with the floss on them then this is just filled with hair ties like i have regular hair ties bobby pins and then those little tiny elastics for my daughter's hair so i just keep them all in here you never know when you need them but all this little stuff that would tend to fall to the bottom of my bag fits great in here and i know exactly where to find all of this so that's that next i have my card holder so this is also coach and it's just a basic card holder with the middle slot. Love it, fits all my stuff great. My main cards, my license, things like that, that's on the back of my phone in my phone wallet because that I always have on me in the store. So this just has like my extra cards in it. Next I just have Icebreaker Mints, but that's not actually what's in here. I have my Mentos gum that I have to refill. I buy the big tubs of these, the Mentos gum, and then I just put some in here because this fits better in a small bag. Next, I have this. This is really old and getting worn off, but this little medicine holder is so great because if you carry a small bag around with you and you have to have something on you, like something you take daily, or if you just like to carry different kind of medications on you for different scenarios, like this is perfect because it's small and compact and fits great in your bags. So I just have that on me. I have hand sanitizer all the time, of course. And this is the Cranberry Peach Pocket Back from Bath & Body Works. I love their hand sanitizers and lotions. I love Bath & Body Works. This smells so good. I got this around the holiday, so. I'm gonna have Mentos mints, chewy mints. I love these. Then I just have a glasses cleaning cloth in here. So next I have a hand cream. This is the Love Beauty and Planet. It's the coconut water and mimosa flower. It smells so good and it's really hydrating. So I really like that. I got that at Target. Next, I just have some eye drops. I keep a little tube of Tylenol in here. I just have some feminine products this oh i love this too this is my singer um tape measure i cannot tell you how many times i have used this on the go when i am out shopping if i need something like for my home that i need to measure it or picture frames like i just i can't tell you how many situations i've been in where i need a tape measure or someone who's with me needs a tape measure and i always have one this is so compact and cute and i just love it Keep it on hand then i have chapstick of course i love this oh it's all dirty um this is the raw sugar 
chapstick. I got this at Target as well. This is my favorite one. It's the lemon sugar. Fun fact, lemons are one of my favorite fruits. I love them. So anything that's lemon scented is just like my favorite. So next I have my headphones. These I got off Amazon as well. They are so amazing. Apple AirPods returning them because they were so uncomfortable in my ear and I got these I found these on Amazon and they work fantastic and they last so long they have such a long battery life they are great then I have chargers so this fits my headphones and then it also fits my keyboard case so i have that in here and then this fits all of my apple devices so my ipad iphone things like that so i just keep those in there and i have the usb block is always in my car and i always have one at work too so i don't have to carry it in my purse then i have some tombos because if you watch my planner videos you know i use tombos to highlight Oh, then I have this. This thing is amazing too. It's called Flow and it's a little refillable perfume spritzer. I got this at Ulta a while back and I don't know if you could find it anywhere else. I'm gonna see if I could find it on Amazon or somewhere for you guys and link it below. I don't know if Ulta still carries this. This was actually the last one when I bought it and that was like a year or two ago. And it's great. I just keep my favorite fragrance in here so i have it on the go so currently i have the victoria's secret bombshell in here but the holiday edition one i love that fragrance i got it around christmas time this past year so i don't know if they're going to be coming out with it again this coming christmas time but such a good fragrance it kind of reminds me of my versace um the crystal bright in the pink bottle I love that fragrance. That's one of my favorites and this reminds me of it. So I like having that Next I have Cough drops. These are probably years old <laughs> These are always floating in the bottom of my bag. That's kind of embarrassing Then I have some change thrown in here and then there's glitter lots of glitter in the bottom of my bag Please tell me why there's so much glitter probably from work but that is everything in my bag. I don't carry much on me, but I think what I carry is necessary for my everyday life. I hope you guys found this video entertaining or helpful. Maybe you found some new little useful items that maybe you'll use in your bags. And especially if you are someone who is going from a large bag to a small bag and don't know how to downsize, uh, maybe this gave you some helpful tips of what you really just need to have on you because I know when you go from a, a large bag to a small bag, you just want to cram everything in it that you own and it does not all fit. And when I used to carry bigger bags, I used to just throw everything in there and it would just be so heavy and stuff that I did not need on me at all. So I have really kind of tailored it down to just the things that I know I need, the things that I will actually use when I am out and about on the go. And I love my bag so much, the Coach little crossbody. Um, it's the Jess crossbody, and I do love the strap. I also have a plain black leather strap too, but this one I really like because it's kind of just fun and sporty looking, so that's what's on it right hope now. If you guys enjoyed this video, I hope that you'll subscribe, like, comment, stick around. Um, if you haven't already, go check out my Instagram. It's underscore plan with B underscore. You could also check out my website, which uh, has my blog on it, which is planwithb.com. And I hope you guys will subscribe to all my platforms. I have a lot of exciting new videos coming out and blogs coming out for you guys. So I hope you will stay tuned and subscribe and follow. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.